This is Sebastian Middle Martinez, MMA News, here at AK Fighting Championship 3, where Alexander Gustafsson just went 10 minutes with Anton Turkal, the young, hungry line, and won by decision. So you finally made it back to the ring, uh, but in a Nogi super fight, and uh, one of the more I guess you could say bloody uh, grappling bouts I've seen. You got a little bit of a bloody nose. He had some scratches on his belly. Uh, how did you feel about the grappling match overall and about the result? No, I, th I, th I think it's, it's was, it was really good. I think it was um, a good night uh, for, for, for all of us, all of us fighters. And, and uh, I think it, it didn't happen that much in our fight, me and Anton's fight. It was kind of hard, hard conditioning with, with, with the ring and everything, but uh, overall we had fun. I saw it as a sparring match, and and it's, it's a way for me to develop my grappling overall. And uh, Anthony is, like you said, a hungry lion. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to see him, see his uh, success, and and his future looks very, very good. Yeah, we spoke to him backstage, and he said the fact that you called him the future and that uh, all the nice things he said about him, that it really meant a lot to him. How far can you see him going? Do you see him going to the UFC in a couple of years? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. He's going to be in the UFC in, in not that, not too long, I think. He's, he's soon there, and, you know, he's, 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 he, I see, you know, as long as he stays humble and, and he, he keeps uh, being this dedicated that he is and, and keep learning and, and, uh, Listen to his coaches. He's gonna he's gonna come very far in in the UFC and uh, yeah, you know the, the future looks very bright for him. And like you said, this is a great event. I think we all had a good time. And what did it feel like to be back? You know, the center stage, main event. You know, hundreds and thousands of fans screaming and cheering you on. What, what was the feeling like when you were getting back in there? Well, incredible. It felt like I was I was back at it. It felt like you know this feeling is. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's like a small local show like this or in the UFC, you know, you're in the ramp in, in that in, in that uh, ring or cage or you just do your thing. It's it's an amazing feeling and, and that's something that, you know, what, what drives us all, all, of us, all fighters, I think. It's just that feeling being, being in the center and, and having fun. And obviously, I mean, you were asked a little bit about it before in Swedish, but for all the English speakers out there, you, as you know, a lot of people do want to see you back in the cage in MMA. I know you're not really certain right now, but like, how are you feeling in general about a potential comeback? I don't know. Let's see what happens. Uh, uh, you know, it's uh, you know, I, I can I can I can't say yes or no. You know, because it's uh, I think you know. Let, let, let's see what the future brings. I, I mean, like uh, I have to take one one day at a time, and I just enjoying this. You know, I train once a day, twice a day sometimes, and just having fun being at the gym and and doing my thing so you know i got a lot of other stuff going on in my life so if, if one day i'll, I'll do an, a, a real comeback then i need to know for sure that everything is on place in place uh, everything in my life uh, just in place and i can i can do this for real you know all right one final question uh, you ever want to come closest to beating John Jones? He's defending his title now against Dominic Reyes, another undefeated young hungry lion. What's your thoughts on that fight and who do you have as a winner? It's going to be an exci exciting fight because uh, uh, Dominic Reyes comes in to, to finish. He comes in, he's, he's pretty wild and he's just doing his thing. So it's going to be a very in 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 interesting fight to see. I can't wait to watch it. Uh, John Jones is a, is, a, is a tough motherfucker, so I think he, you know. He's just doing his thing, and he's probably going to win this fight, but uh, it's always in, in entertaining to see. So, uh, And it's always a pleasure to speak with you. We appreciate the time, and, yeah, we hope we see you back sooner rather than later. Thank you so much. All right. Thanks.